Meantime, the area on Okakanfu of Yoruba land, Ghani Adams, has expressed worries over the unfolding state of anarchy in the southeast region, which is traceable to the reoccurrence of kidnapping, arson, maiming, destruction of economic facilities, and killings. The Odua People's Congress leader, Ghani Adams, while addressing some Yoruba leaders at the Pan Yoruba Congress held at the Mapo Hall in Ibadan, noted with dismay the state of insecurity in Nigeria and the ancestral space of Yoruba land, a situation which he said has compelled a rigorous interrogation of the menace. He also stressed that the present insecurity situation in the country and southwest region calls for unity of people across all divides, including politics, religion, social and economy, warning that when injustice becomes law, resistance will be a duty. With this now, we Yorubas we understand where we are going, to all to speak in one voice. And you can see we are all speaking in one voice now. And you know very soon we shall get there. We need to work hand to hand. We need to work hand to hand. And we need to, everybody is a police, we need to polarize all our area. We're here today just to make sure that we plan how to protect ourselves, may God protect us. Federal government is not interested in protecting anybody. It's as if nobody is protecting any, uh, anybody. So we have to come together as your your urban nation to protect ourselves. I think it's a welcome development. It's a starting point. We'll be working on our people so that more people can join a success train. Uh, we need this kind of meeting because of the security threat and our economy, especially the issue of agriculture. And you can see what everybody has said here today. The communique has been rolled out. We send it to the gentlemen of the press. And uh, you now know what we want to unveil to move your nation forward. In his address at the gathering, the Oyo State Governor, Shei Makinde, solicited the support of the non-state actors to effectively tackle the menace of insecurity and economic flaws in all your states and in the country at large. I will take decision in the best interest of my people. Security architecture of all your states, we must not incorporate non-state actors. But what we want to achieve he however promised that his government will consider the recommendations contained in the communique of the congress with a view to adopt and implement them Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.